Hey tubers, here's a video on um, how to edit in GarageBand. So, I recorded an old audition. I got a script from an agent and recorded it, and it sounds kind of like this. Okay, so you know that there's some things that we need to fix. We've got, we're in the time mode right here. So you can tell by counting up on this, before I even say my name, there's seven seconds. So let's go to the brackets. And we're going to move that and, and drag that right before I say my name. So then when you go to the beginning. Hi, this is Dave. Okay, cool. Now you've got about five seconds before you even start. So. Okay. The year was not. Okay. If you want to zoom out, take your two fingers on the trackpad on your laptop and pinch out. And then take your two fingers and move it to slide it to the right. I'm going to move the playhead after I slate it, slated my name and and do the command command T, which will split the playhead. Now we've got our in point. Okay. The year and that's the beginning of of it. You see right here, that's a breath. This large this larger portion is me speaking. So when you're editing. It's easier to see the, 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 the things that are mistakes are very short rather than long. You can tell that this is a whole sentence and it's carrying on and there's a breath. And if you go along, you can see that looks like a breath. Generally, the breaths are right before. There's a breath there, are right before a sentence. There's a little breath. There's probably something there. So. If we get back to the beginning here, we know that that's the start of it. So I'm going to take the bracket and take that all the way to right after the breath. And then I'm going to move this probably, let's try it right up to it. It might be too close, and I'll maybe move it back. Hi, this is Dave. The year was 19... Yeah, that seems a little bit too much. So I'm going to take this, and I'm just going to move it back, like, an, a second. Hi, this is Dave. The year was 1908. Henry Ford's Model T had just hit the road, and buying a house was kind of like the wild, wild west. Until one day... Until one day, some real estate... Until one day, some real estate folks named a code of F. Until one day. Okay, so I know that I screwed up. I said un until one day, pause, until one day, and then I screwed up. And then until one day, and I got it further, and I finally got it right later on. So I'm going to go in front of this first one, and I'm going to do Command T, which is going to split the, the track. Now I know that that's my endpoint. My exit point is going to be further on down. Let's let's. Uh, until one day, some real estate folks named a code of eth. Until one day, some real estate folks formed a code of ethics. Okay, so I like that one. I'm going to put the playhead there. Do Command T as well. Click on that one. I'm going to zoom out so you can see all of this. because it gets confusing. That's my slate. That's the first couple sentences. These are all those screw-ups. This portion is highlighted. 
that is highlighted when it's got the bar above that. So this is the part that I don't want. I'm going to delete it. I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to move this over to where the end was and I'm going to move the playhead back to a sentence before so I can play it back and hear how the edit sounds. The wild, wild west. Until one day, some real estate folks formed a code of ethics. They started calling themselves... Okay, I don't know if you heard, there's like a little bit of a clipped breath. The wild, wild west. Until one... Can I hear like a... So I'm going to go in there and I'm going to take the bracket all the way to right before the the word and then I'm going to take the bracket here right after this so you can hear that now we've cut out where the breath was like the wild wild west until one day some that's kind of a primer on editing out breaths some real estate folks formed a code of ethics they started calling there's another breath right here we can edit that out if you want put the playhead there you have to make sure that you are editing a region that you are highlighted that have that you have highlighted put the playhead there command t put the playhead there command t highlight the region that you want to delete and delete now let's go back a couple seconds and listen to it so that you can see how the spacing is code of ethics they started calling themselves realtors and turned the wild wild west of real estate into the into more of an ethical north south east and west okay so there's another screw up there and turned the wild wild west of real estate into the into more of an ethical north you see where I said into the, and I screwed that up and took a pause, and then I said the line correctly. I'm going to go zoom out a little bit so we can see this better. And I'm going to go right before that line, see that that's highlighted, Command T. I'm going to go right here, right before the correct line, Command T. I'm going to highlight the region I don't want, hit Delete. Drag this forward. <clears throat> now, if we go forward, and turn the wild, wild west of real estate into more of an ethical north, south, east, and west, which at the time was. There's a breath there we can get rid of. Command T. Command T. Highlight the one you don't want. Delete. And west, which at the time was pretty wild but is actually what we still adhere to today. Which at the time was pretty wild, but is... Which at the time was pretty wild, but is actually what we still adhere to today. Okay. So, for whatever reason, <clears throat> I didn't like... Which at the time was pretty wild, didn't but is like actually these. what we still adhere to today. Which at the time was pretty wild, but is... Which at the time was pretty wild, but is actually what we still adhere to today. That's who we are. Okay, so I did it once, didn't like it, redid it, screwed it up, and then did it the third time and liked it. So we can either um, Command T, put the playhead here, hit Command T, delete this, or you can take the bracket and go all the way to there. Either way, it doesn't matter, and then bring this a little bit closer to that we'll zoom out so that we can see what the spacing is between here and here south east and west which at the time was pretty wild but is actually what we still adhere to today and that sounds pretty good there is a breath in the front so i'm going to take the bracket here and go right after that little mouth noise or clip and if you go back and listen more of an ethical north, south, east, and west, which at the time was pretty wild, but is actually what we still adhere to today. That's who we are. Okay, and then I've got some stuff here at the end, so I'm just going to clean that up to the end and go right back to 
right after that. Now I'm going to hit the return button, go to the beginning, and I'm going to zoom out so we get the whole thing. Okay. The whole thing now is somewhere under 30 seconds. So here's this audition with all the edits that we've done. Hi, this is Dave. The year was 1908. Henry Ford's Model T had just hit the road, and buying a house was kind of like the wild, wild west. Until one day, some real estate folks formed a code of ethics. They started calling themselves realtors and turned the wild, wild west of real estate into more of an ethical north, south, east, and west, which at the time was pretty wild, but is actually what we still adhere to today. That's who we are. All right, and then hit return, and now you can share this via export song to disk and put it in your folder so you can create a new folder on in your desk on your desktop and call this auditions create call this test audition mp3 highest quality export and there it's done and that's how you do basic editing with breaths in GarageBand.